guys. So I don't normally do hair tutorials, but I thought it would be kind of fun today to go over how I got my hairstyle for that fun 40s keyhole dress tutorial that I did. So here's how I did it. I did a little bit of Google searching and then I came up with my own hairstyle. Um, but as you can see, I have straight hair. Um, this is how it blow dries out naturally. Um, if you have a wave to your hair, I'm very jealous, but I always have to curl it before I do anything. So I just kind of put it up halfway. I have very thick hair also. I put it up halfway and then I use a basic two inch curling iron and I curl all of my hair about two inch increments towards the front of my face. This takes me, I'm gonna say five to 10 minutes. So I do this, uh, as you see, I curl it towards the front of my face and I do that all around. When I get this side, I do towards my face going in the other direction. And I do this all around my hair and when I hit to the back, that's when I kind of switch the curling iron. So I'll be back to you when I'm done. <laughs> Okay, so I finished curling my hair, and now this is the part that always scares me when it comes to doing something different with your hair. Um, I'm gonna brush out the curls. So, I'm just taking it, and what you can see is it kind of creates a more of a wave, which was very popular back in the 40s. I know a lot of 40s tutorials will tell you to use the, um, the rollers, but I didn't have rollers, so I worked with what I had. So there we go. Now I've used no product um, as of yet. Again, feel free to use product pre-curling. Um, just make sure it's not sticky so that your hair won't get stuck to the curling iron. So now here's how I got that fun little um, roll in my hair. Uh, I'm going to take my hair and I parted it a little bit more over to the side. your bangs in your in your roll or not my bangs are a little short so I kind of kept them out and then styled them afterwards separately and I grabbed as much hair as I want in the roll I grabbed over here so you can see it's all here then I used just a tubular object I used my lipstick queen lip gloss Ooh, love this stuff and I kind of put it on the end of my hair and wrapped my hair around it keeping it nice and tight and then I rolled my hair up making sure I held on to both ends of the lip gloss tube. Again, you can use anything you want, whatever tube, tubular object you happen to have on hand. I'm sure there are some professional products that you can use. That's just what I happen to have in my drawer in front of me. So once I have all my hair rolled up, I take some bobby pins, and I'm just going to insert into the hair in various spots to kind of hold it in place. front you're gonna use a boatload of bobby pins by the time this is all said and done so hopefully you'll have a whole new roll to use I'm putting bobby pins in the front in the back on top and once I feel I have just about enough to at least hold the roll in place I remove the lipstick tube I'm not there we go look at that how cool is that so I've removed them now I'm gonna put in a whole bunch more bobby pins. I mean, we are going to bobby pin it up. It's actually pretty secure right now. I like to make sure that my hair, because I have the bangs to worry about, it's kind of in a nice place. Bobby pin those sections in place. And let's just assume I have a million more bobby pins because I'm gonna dance the night away. I'm gonna put at least 10 to 15 more in here. And then once it's all said and done, I will hairspray the crap all out of it. <laughs> and that's how you do it. It's really that simple. Uh, one thing, because I felt like my hair was kind of flat over here, I did take a little small section and just kind of pinned it up in a way like it was in a barrette. On this side, and that's the general gist of it. You see, I just kind of pinned in place, hair spread away, and I had a really super cute hairstyle, perfect for 1940s uh, dance that I'm going to. So thanks so much for watching. Thanks for bearing with me. Um, I would love uh, to see if you ended up making one for yourself, if you did your hairstyle, as well as any extra tips on how you could maybe make it even more special. You know, put it up in a little section over here, do another victory roll. There's so much you can do. Uh, but that's how I did my hairstyle. Thanks so much. Have a great day. Goodbye.